previously born to God. There. You got it. Gates is my boyfriend. Ah, you got it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's a little on the pricey side, but for you, there will be a discount. You can't abandon me in the middle of my training. Not my responsibility to get light. Oh, is that right? Yeah, I'm pretty certain of it. New. We got room for one more. Who's it gonna be? Gates, the board is a mess. You're only seeing three patients. Feel free to pitch in. No, no, no. My job is to supervise and teach. Your job is to move the meat. Or you know, when I was a resident, I had what was called a work ethic. Yes, you set the bar high. Oh, you bet I did. And now as an attending, it's not as easy as it looks. I gotta keep an eye on all you guys. Dr. DeBanco? Sam 3 is clear. Bring me syncope, patigo, and nausea. Poor guy heard he just quit. No Thank way. You. I'm looking for Dr. Lockhart. Me too. Well, when you see her, tell her I need one more prescription. I can't see. What happened? We were down the street from the explosion. Explosion? Yeah, over on Michigan. They said it was an ambulance. Who went in that rig? Get Bardelli on the radio. Set up the trauma room. Dumar. You seen Sam? Yeah. All right, let's roll. I didn't get a call. Come on, drive. That's it. Start it Unit 16 Covers gram positives and negatives. Okay, but not being on the roads. Ready 
I need to get some more. Tony, do you mind calling my mom? I don't want her to hear something on the news. No problem. Our student of all niggas up. Might as well need to buy. Well, Thor, he's got a good airway. He's gonna need a surgery. And that's why we have anesthesiologists, and we're putting a central line taking right up to the OR. Right, I'm gonna make that call. You guys all right? Hang up and take them off. Are you back at work? 
your neck when it's over. Oh, I need a hiss to the back. Could get a sponge stick on it. Do you think you want to ask for it? Oh, the trick tube has a cup. Open up, Greg. He's doing okay. I think a piece of mandible cut his carotid. Just see the sooner. Unless you got the wall of the artery and it took time to close. Got it. Okay, base nine and cut down tray. What are you doing? I need to tie off his carotid. Can I off his carotid? It's gonna cut off the blood to have his brain. Paralysis and invasion. He's got collateral through the circle of Willis. You hope. There's an open artery. I can either let him bleed out or we can accept the risk of a stroke. You think he's gonna die if you don't? You understand? Should I call that? How about Patina? Try yourself. Some burning with Lido? Abby, right now. Multifocal PPCs runs a VTAC. Well, where's the blood gas? Your pH is very low. What is that? Bacteria? Superficial bleeders? Hemostat. They have enough doctors in there, okay? My daughter needs you. Okay, all right, okay. Um, she's got a profound gap acidosis, but her oxygen level is normal. Did she adjust anything? Uh, yeah. That's it. That's probably it. Cyanide. Mix two grams of hydroxocobalamin. That's the antidote. Sometimes when a car interior burns, it releases cyanide. As soon as it gets here, we'll give it to her. Shifts. 
was a lot of patience. He would tell us to get out there and take care of business. That's what he'd say. Pressure's down, 90 over 60. 500 of silane, check a crit. She bleeding in her pelvis? Wasn't that impressive on the same time? Maybe we got behind in the fluids. I want to push vitamin K. What for? Because she's probably on Coumadin. Well, we never got a history, she can't speak. She's in AFib. ST segments are consistent with the Jackson use. She's probably on a blood thinner too. Makes sense. Suppose vitamin K couldn't hurt. Let's get it to trauma, try it, call the blood bank for FFP. Pretty smart for a med student. Book smart, she's got a ways to go. Wait up, guys. I was crutch training. We're moving to another room. You gotta keep me in the loop here. I gotta know these things. It's an ancient Chinese proverb. He who saves a life is responsible for it. No cardiac activity. It's only been two hours. I need to ask you about something. Craig's wallet has an organ donor card. I want to make sure that's okay. He's not dead yet. If it comes to that and do what he wanted. She has been here a long time. Let's just take a break. I'm fine. Hi, Bettina. It's Sam again from the ER. Call us when you get this. Up 
Aunt Jo can take her. Okay, that sounds like a plan. Well, she doesn't need Viola. You're looking at such an experienced med student. Okay. Let's go. EEG remained isoelectric. No brain stem evoked responses. But that's like a 10 minutes. PCO2 is 74. 74? Anything over 60 means brain death. I'm so sorry, Chaz. <laughs> signs to monitor <laughs> not yet can you please just keep this thing going a couple more hours no no he, he could come back maybe he'll come back his heart's gone his brain's gone <sighs> we're pronouncing him Hey, 
Abby. Hang. It's nice to see Luca at the funeral. Yeah. Is he coming to Lakes? No. He had a plane to catch. It's good to see you together. Amen to that. Neela, they need you in drama. Do you have time to get into my scrubs? Of course not. Luca said something about an interview in Boston. Yeah. We were thinking about moving. But now, I'm not so sure. It's hard to imagine leaving this place. What do you need? You were the for the source. Bingo. It feels fluctuant. Would you like to be honest? Please don't move the gloves. I hate to engage. Do I need to wash out in the OR? That sounds all right. It's also good that you have a little more time off as well, you know. Oh, man. What? I'm not sure how to do this. Do what? I've been holding on to something. Now I know that there's never going to be a right time. So. <gasps> this is for you. It was in Greg's pocket on the day he died. Last week, trying to be a hero. Yeah. Um, I've been thinking a lot about last week and about how Pratt would let me get on that ambulance. So I don't want to waste time. I just want you to know I wouldn't be with you if I didn't think that we could have something real. I feel the same. Sam, Gates, you guys know about Ike's? Uh -huh. Yeah. That's it. That's it. We'll, uh, we'll try to start around. 8.30, if anyone has anything they want to say, you know, share a story or a memory, that would be the time. You know what, can you hang up or take that someplace else? Sorry, that was Aunt's spot. Uncle Donnie? He thought that everyone should know that they were going to offer Greg the job. He was going to be the chief of the ER.
looked at a medical website and they said it was probably a virus. I didn't even think about what was going on underneath my cast. Yeah, not a good idea to scratch your skin with a wire coat hanger. Oh, the itching was driving me nuts. Hey, let me ask you something. Is this an unusual case? Do you think you could, like, write this up for the journals? Norman, I think you need a rest. So do I. Hello there. Someone wanted to see you. Oh, my God! I didn't know you made it! They wouldn't give me information on the phone and I couldn't see you because I'm not a relative. Norman, easy! Oh, it's so good to see you. Oh, thank you. Thank you for saving me. You look fantastic. Well, uh, let the two of you uh, catch up. So are you going to Ike's? Mm-hmm. Should I wait for you? No. He's taken a leak, and he finds Morris hiding in a stall on his cell phone, getting advice about a case. He storms back to the desk and tells me, that kid couldn't find his ass with both hands. <laughs> Okay, excuse me, everybody. Um, tonight's not about speeches or anything, but I was going to say something. I was wondering if anybody else... If... Sorry. This is from the church. I thought it should be here. Who, uh, who wants to start? Sometimes after a really gnarly shift, Greg would drag me over here, buy me a beer, and we would uh, we would share an order of his all-time favorite, deep-fried mozzarella sticks. Yeah, he'd say that the clams might be frozen and the mushrooms might be bad, but you can never go wrong with mozzarella. So, uh, I invite all of you to <laughs> dip deep into the marinara and uh, raise your cheese as we embrace the memory of our colleague, our mentor, our chief, and our dear friend. Thank you. 